Welcome everybody, WMB the Gaming Guy here. We are um, going to start a new game series. This is on Wilhelmina Forest. And as you can see, we're at the shop. And I purchased some equipment. And also purchased, purchased the land. So, um, let me show you what land we're talking about. Which we purchased. So we actually purchased these two sections of land right here, and we're up here. Okay. So, um, well, actually, yeah, so we're going to drive over there and I'll show you the property. Also, we'll probably have to come back and pick up uh, that fuel bowser over there, the fuel tank or whatever. See it over there by the pole, the yellow tank. So, uh, let's head over there. The roads are kind of bumpy here. It's not going to really take it easy. By the way, I didn't purchase that truck. That's mine. I've had that for years. This is a small little town here. Hasn't barely, really developed too much. gas stations over here. Actually, as long as we're here, I think we're going to fuel up. I think my truck has enough gas in it, but... Let's see... step inside the tractor find out if there's enough gas in that way to get in there I was just thinking things acting up on me what's going on well, let's fill her up Which things bounce around so much. Let's bring that down. Oh, damn. Why is this thing doing this? That's weird. Now well, let's keep it like that. I don't know what's going on with this thing. Good to go. As you can see, the roads are kind of steep here. And bumpy. Here's the log mill. Actually, it's a lumber mill, too.
Mm, this is uh, uh so you sell your grain and crops right over here. I don't know what that building is over there. That brick building, then you get a barn right over here. Well, I don't know what that is for. We'll find out. And this is the uh, animals. Station. And as you can see, the road gets hit to the run over here. So it hasn't really been developed yet, so they didn't really put gravel down on it. And over this bridge is our property. Over the lake here. And as you can see, I already did some work here and cleared out a section over here to park the vehicle. Okay. Let me show you around. First of all, we got the John Deere tractor here 690 691 s what's that an 08 and uh got the front loader attachment we got the log uh, attachment to pick up the logs and the grinder for the grinding the stumps And also, we got a winch here to pull the trees out. Makes it a little bit easier to trim them down, to delimit them after you pull them out of the woods. Okay, our trailer. This is all purchased back here. Purchased this all yesterday. The truck, like I said, the truck is mine. As you can see, there's a few logs sitting here. I think I had to cut down one tree. It's over here by the lake. And I'm planning on putting a fence here with a gate. And with my luck, I have good luck over here with my luck. There was an old hunting cabin sitting here on the property, so I'm utilizing that. Live it until I can buy, build a new place to live further down my property. And I set it up nice here. bedrooms over here and a nice little wood burning stove and of course here's the outhouse place to go to the bathroom yeah. all right let's like I said on my property we're gonna head down to where I plan on putting my uh, new home eventually and clear out some land to do uh, put some fields in and do a little farming here lay off the grid series As you can see the Sun is setting fast it's a little dark here the flashlight on here is better so we can see where we're walking I picked out an area where it's pretty flat so I could um, put some fields in. A long ways back here. 
as you can see it's pretty hilly here we should be coming up on it soon should be another little trail branching off to the left here somewhere Let's see here. There it is. There's the other trail back as well. As you can see, it starts to flatten out. A little bit on this side of the trail, but mostly over here. It's a big plot of land here where it's pretty flat. And I'm not too sure where I'm going to be putting putting the new cabin or a little home. Basically, it's gonna be on this side of the trail, overlooking the lake. And as you can see, it's pretty flat back in here. Perfect for a field, a couple fields at least. You can do some logging back in here. A lot of opportunities to make some money. So I think what I may end up doing is um let me put it around in here somewhere a cabin or in the house i'm not too sure yet i mean as you can see our property i don't want to be too close to the property over here which i didn't buy so either somewhere over here or here, I I think. Maybe I will go over here. I'm not too sure yet. Um, it's not really important, important to make that decision right now. Because everything I develop as far as um, fields and all that and lawn will be on this side of the trail. But... Uh, Well, maybe here somewhere. It's a nice little view here of the lake. Maybe face the cabin at an angle, cut a few of these trees down. And maybe I could possibly put a dock in here. I don't want to go in too far, it's pretty wet. As you can see, there's like a little inlet area here. I think that would be nice. Put my cabin up in here somewhere. Not too close to the lake, probably around in this area somewhere. I still want some land in back of the cabin. See what it looks like over here. Now we're getting pretty close to the other end of the property here, but this is still nice too. I don't know. Maybe somewhere in here. Let's see something here. Hmm. I guess I'm wearing her coat over there either. It's pretty nice too. Got that little end that here. I also put it on the corner of the property. I do I don't want to go too close to that little that little inlet and to the other adjacent land that I don't know we may be buying it at some point in time so no, 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 that's kind of nice too here I like the view here especially with the little inlet to take out that tree there see what it looks like across the uh, trail Trails right here. Well, we can always move that trailer over a little bit. Still looks pretty flat here.
I don't want to spend too much time here. I want to get back to the cabin because uh, we're burning daylight here. I mean, it's pretty flat, as you can see. So even if I don't even develop it over here in the front or the back of the cabin, I can always, you know, run down a little bit back down the path, the trail. And uh, start cutting out, cutting down some trees, harvesting that area right there. You know, I kind of like that. Be kind of sheltered with the wind off the lake with this little uh, inlet. Yeah, I like it. I really do. So we'll probably end up putting it there. I can always just start developing it over here. Put all my um my sheds and barn or whatever on that side to store my equipment right across the trail from where the cabin would be. <clears throat> Alright, sounds good. So let's head back. It's getting dark out. This is gonna be kind of a short video just wanted to show you guys uh, what I plan on doing here so pretty flat up in here till we come to that uh, trail that branches off over here to the right then it starts getting a little hilly on the other side of that trail Which I still own anyway. I could, you know, just log that out and plant some new trees there. You know, here's that other trail. And as you can see, it starts a, an incline over here. And this is mostly flat on this side. So I think that's going to work out fine. <clears throat> At first, I was just going to purchase one plot of land. I decided to purchase that other one. It was such a good bargain. Plus, when I was looking at the map, I kind of saw that that other plot, the last plot I bought, was more flatter. So I decided to purchase it. So what let's do is start start uh, clearing the land, start logging it out, make some money out of the logs with the uh, with the logs. Start paying off that loan. Like I said, I kind of lucked out having that cabin over there close to the bridge. It's going to work out, work out fine. Because I don't know, I figured I'd have to buy a little trailer or something to live in until I build the house. There's a nice little rock cropping there. I like that. It's another view of the lake across, across the way. And I will be continuing my uh, videos. I've been kind of slacking on that, making videos of uh, Bucks County and Ravenport. But I have been working on them two maps. So um, I just wanted to start a new one, new map series, a new game series. Oh, got kind of bored with those two. It'll break up things a little bit. Okay, we're back at the cabin here, as you can see. Okay, so um, that's it for today, guys. Like I said, I just want to show you when I'm starting here. So until my next video, hopefully I'll do the, I'll do another video on this, and I'll probably jump back to uh, Ravenport or Bucks County. So 
Um, this is WMB, uh, the gaming guy. Um, have a good day.